Um, he says, how do you get a turkey to gobble? Try gobbling, Henry says, and see if he gobbles back. Alex blinks. Are you serious? We hunt loads of wild turkeys in the spring, Henry says sagely. The trick is to get into the mind of the turkey. How the hell do I do that? So, Henry instructs, do as I say. You have to get quite close to the turkey, like physically. Carefully, still cradling the phone close, Alex leans towards the wire bars. Okay. Make eyes with the turkey. Do you have it? Alex follows Henry's instructions in his ear, planting his feet and bending his knees so he's at cornbread's eye level. A chill running down his spine when his own eyes lock on the beady, black murder eyes. Yeah. Right. Now hold it, Henry says. Connect with the turkey. Earn the turkey's trust. Befriend the turkey. Uh, okay. Buy a summer home in Mallorca with the turkey. Oh, I hate you! Alex shouts as Henry laughs at his own idiotic prank and his indignant philaling starts to uh, startles a loud gobble out of cornbread, which in turn startles a very unmanly scream out of Alex. I'm not doing the scream. Ah! We have a turkey. Its name was not cornbread. It was nameless. Uh, and we had so many takes with this thing. And it wasn't the turkey. This turkey was a, a little diva turkey. It was uh, me having to cover the turkey. <laughs> that was the issue. Uh, but we shot him out, movie star style, was there for like an hour, and uh, they went home. I would say this is a really pivotal moment for Alex and Henry, especially because they are slowly becoming friends just over text message. Um, and so that's the only way they're learning. Uh, this is, I would say, like their first phone call. We don't really see them chat on the phone before this. And by the end of the scene, you can tell that Alex is feeling something for Henry, but I don't think he knows it's more than friendship. Good night. Oh.